Okay, so a few videos back we did competition style heel work. So now we're going to up it into a trick and see if we can go forwards and backwards in heel work position. Great, so he went straight for it. I haven't done that with him before, so it was new for us as well. So all we did was we got him into the idea of doing his close heel work, so we G'd him up to that. And then once he was in the mood for it, we then stopped. I then asked him to stand, because every time we stop, we sit in heel work. So I um, asked him to stand, so that was another command we had to throw in there. And then I asked him to back up. So that's two commands we had to throw in there. And both of those, I've got separate videos which you'll be able to find on our trick playlist somewhere. All I did was keep the tree out in front of his face so he knew where to target or where to look. And he kept himself close to my leg and backwards we went. Now let's try Coda. So whereas Nick was able to keep it nice and straight, whereas he has been doing heel work in the past before, so he knows to keep close to my leg, Coda doesn't. So we had a bit of a, an issue where he didn't quite keep straight. So you can easily fix that by moving the treat about. If you move it out away from your leg, then his back end will, <laughs> will angle in towards you, so it'll keep him straighter towards you. If you move it in towards you, his back end will move out away from you and he'll move away from you. So you can easily control your dog with the placement of your treat. <laughs> Ideally you want it just in front, just like I did with Nick's, and keep them straight. It's like um, driving a car with a trailer on the back, I suppose. Depending on which way your wheel goes, your trailer is going to go in a different direction. So yeah, that is your hill work in reverse. Don't forget to subscribe for me and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.